Is DCIS breast cancer? Many women wonder about this. So what is DCIS? So actually, let's break it down. DCIS stands for ductal carcinoma in situ. So basically, it's breast cancer cells that have not invaded the normal tissue yet. It's considered a stage zero breast cancer, but it technically does not have the potential to spread to other organs. That being said, a woman who's diagnosed with DCIS has an increased risk of developing invasive breast cancer. So what are the signs and symptoms of DCIS? Very few actually. Women usually will not present with many symptoms and most of the DCIS are actually picked up on mammogram. But sometimes some women can present with a mass or some nipple discharge. So how does it present on mammogram? So most DCIS actually present as microcalcifications and these microcalcifications would actually be biopsied and that's how you get the diagnosis. So what is the treatment for DCIS? So actually the area of DCIS has to be removed and we do that by surgery. Now depending on how large the area is, you might have a lumpectomy or a total mastectomy. Now we've created some videos on both of those surgical procedures, so we'll link them below. In addition to surgery, do women with DCIS need lymph node sampling? In the vast majority of cases, no, but in certain circumstances, your surgeon might actually recommend it. So, are there additional treatments needed beyond surgery? Yes. Women are actually surprised by that because it's not invasive cancer, so they think surgery is enough. But most of the cases, women will require some radiation therapy and or hormone therapy. And so what about chemo? The good news is chemotherapy is not required for this. So this was a quick overview of DCIS. Head over to our twobreastsurgeons.com website for more information. We'll see you next time.